Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? It is Bash with another commentary for you. I have a demolition. I'm playing on Crash. Um, yes, Bash and Crash do rhyme. I tried my best to avoid that, but uh, whatever. Guess it happened. <laughs> um, so I'm playing demolition. I think I've only, I only have one other demolition uh, up ever that I've ever commentated over. So uh, something new for you guys. Um, I'm also using the P90, a gun that I don't use a lot. I don't think I've ever commentated over it. I do use it a lot, but um, I don't know. I've just never done a commentary over it. Um, I find that um, I, I, you know, I don't play Modern Warfare 2 as much as I used to, um, and when I do get on, I try to choose the setup that will get me, uh, that is most likely to get me the best score, so I can get a video for you guys or something entertaining for you to watch. Um, but ever since the Black Ops multiplayer reveal was dropped, like my love for the Call of Duty franchise has kind of been rekindled. So um, you know, <laughs> I guess you could say I'm playing it a lot more. So uh, you know, I'm playing with different setups that I think will give me the most joy and the most fun. And uh, one of them is this P90 setup. Um, as you guys saw, I just rushed straight into their spawn. And that's pretty much what I do on every game that I'm using this P90 or uh, or the Mini Uzi setup, which I do use sometimes. I've been playing around with that too. Um, and man, I just run straight to their spawn. I try to wreak havoc. I try to cause problems. Um, I try to be a pain in the butt pretty much. I just try to keep moving as much as I can. But um, this is Demolition and this is a an objective game type. So uh, as you can see here, they've gone ahead and planted uh, the bomb at B. Or, yeah, I'd be. And I'm going to try to defuse it. Um, you guys will notice that halfway through, I do stop defusing it. If you're wondering, why the hell did you stop defusing it? Um, it was because I see on my on my radar, there's a guy right to my left. And um, I don't realize that the person behind me actually killed them. Um, I should have just kept defusing. But uh, now when I try to defuse, obviously, there's a grenade that kills me and I blow up. And, um, you know, it's funny because I try to go back and defuse the bomb right here. And I was always under the impression that it's five seconds to defuse. And, I mean... I started defusing it, or you know, at least I start putting my gun away and getting the laptop out, or I mean the box, the suitcase out, when there's like 5.5 seconds. But for whatever reason, um, I guess it isn't five seconds to defuse to detonate. But um, you know, um, I think that one of the, I mean, I think that maybe it's possible that it's five seconds from when the, the uh, briefcase is fully out, or uh, maybe it's six seconds. I don't know. If anyone anyway, you guys know the information on that, uh, be you know, it'd be great if you could share that with the rest of the, uh, you know, the viewers. Because I have no clue. I always was on, I was always under the pressure that was five seconds. So, um, and you can see right here, this guy's trying to attack me, and he's on. Uh, he's he's taking cover behind a car, and that car has not blown up. So here I am reloading my gun, and I'm like, yep, I already know what I'm gonna do. So I threw my semtex, figuring that it would blow him up and kill him, but it didn't. So I finished off the job. Um, so I mean, this game's been out for a while now, and you guys have heard every tip possible but um if you're gonna take cover behind a car make sure it's already blown up uh same with like a propane tank or you know gas tanks anything like that if, you, if you're gonna take cover behind those things make sure they've already blown up because uh all someone has to do is just spray it down and uh, blow it up for you to get blown up so you know watch out um but yeah enough about the game you know we pretty much we do what we always do and we just kind of come back we rally back and um we, we do take this game in the end but uh, something I want to talk about was my um one of my one of my recent commentaries my birthday commentary actually where I gave you guys some advice on um, I guess it was school and the importance of school and how important how really important it is um, you know for the rest of your life and all that stuff um, I've been getting a lot of questions since then like a lot of I don't know advice kind of based questions people asking me about school about girlfriends about boyfriends about parents um about jobs you know about different things about youtube channels i always get um you know obviously i always get the um questions people asking for advice on their youtube channel and that's cool um but i figured with the um i mean whenever someone sends me a message and they take the time and the effort to you know send a properly you know well put together message i try to put the same effort in, in a response and um you know lately just because i guess because after that video a lot of people have kind of been asking me a lot of questions and um, it's been hard for me to kind of keep up. So what I've decided to do is um, I'm going to take, I decided to kind of take all the questions that I get and um, put them over some commentary. So the reason I'm telling you guys this is because it's kind of like an open invitation to you guys. Um, if you have anything you want to um, ask me or, you know, I'm, I'm 24, so I've been through a little bit of, you know, some of the people who are a little bit younger than me. You know, you may have some questions about school. You may have some questions about whatever it is, work, about, you know, friends, parents. Uh, you know, and also, you you up-and-coming commentators, if you have questions about your channel, what you can do to, you know, get exposure. If you have 30 videos up and people aren't watching them, they're good quality and just don't understand why. 
um, you know, go ahead and ask. Send me the question in a private message. And uh, what I'll do is I'll gather up all the messages. I'll gather up all the questions. And uh, I'll answer them over some commentary. So, you know, if you guys have any questions, come to me. I got answers for you. That's going to be that's gonna be the punchline, actually. You got questions, I got answers. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I mean, just, just I think that would be cool. Something interesting to talk about. I mean, I lo I'd love to give you guys tips and, you know, give you guys my insight on this game. But we all know how often that is that has been done. Uh, you know, the, this game's coming to, like, end of life almost at this point. And, uh, you know, I figured I, I might as well use the, the gameplay to entertain you guys and come up with some new uh, and hopefully exciting uh, commentary. So, also, Halo Reach is coming out in a week. And uh, I'm not a big Halo guy. I started out playing Halo before I played Modern Warfare 2. And that was kind of my game of choice. Um, I played that the most. Um, but I only played it for fun. I, I never really took it too seriously at all. I, I would go like, what, 5 and 30? And I'd be like, ah, that was fun. You know, I just had a good time, whatever. It was nothing serious. But uh, since then, you know, I started playing Modern Warfare 2, taking these games a little more seriously. I want to get good scores. I don't find it fun when I'm losing, um, <laughs> as most of you guys probably don't either. So, I mean, um, Halo is not really... I mean, I was, I was kind of hyped up for the Halo Reach. Once um, the beta was coming out and there was a whole bunch of buzz surrounding it. Um, but after I played the Halo Reach beta, it really wasn't my cup of tea. I don't know if it was because I was playing the same games, game types over and over again. If it was because I was playing against, like, you know, pro players who were just raping me. But, um, you know, I'm not as hyped up for it as I once was. I'll still go pick it up and I'll play it quite a bit. Hopefully it'll hold me off until um, uh, November when uh, Black Ops does come out. But, um, I mean, I, I don't see myself playing too much of it. Um, I mean, I, I can give you guys gameplay if that's what you want. If you guys want to see gameplay, uh, let me know in the comment section and I'll definitely bring it to you guys. But listen, don't expect any MLG legit plays or like cool tips and tricks or how to play the game um, because I know none of that. If you want some of that, you know, you should check out T-Mart, Dunkus, uh, Bendro. Like, check those guys out. They're pro at the game. They know what they're doing. Me, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm just going to go out there. I'm going to wing it. I'm going to have some fun. If that's what you guys want to see, let me know. If you're not really too interested in it, you know, it's cool. You can don't don't say anything. But if you want to see some reach and you want my comment my commentary on it, um, yeah, go ahead and uh, just leave a leave a comment. But um this game's winding down. We did make a pretty big comeback. Um, you know, on defense, I guess it's harder for us to control. Actually it's easier for us to control, but uh, being the greedy people we are, we're, we're, we're trying to get all the kills that we can, so we're always running around, not necessarily uh, camping the bomb sites like I guess the objective says we should. <laughs> but um, you know, on offense, it's pretty easy for us. We just rush the bomb sites, and we plant it, we get it over with, like you've seen. So uh, yeah, that's about it. So once again, if you guys have any questions, uh, send them to me, private message, and uh, I'll address them. I'll get to them, and um, you know, hopefully, uh, I'll have a little series out of that. If I get more than, you know, if I get a lot of a lot of messages, I'll make a series out of it. We'll do it in you know a couple sessions, whatever. You already know. Um, follow me on Twitter. Oh, I have news about what I'm going to do for my Twitter followers. But I'll tell you that in the future. Um, follow me on Twitter. Bash LOL. That's my Twitter name. See y'all later. Peace.